All right, guys, so I received this pack from Faraday, and um, it was really intriguing to me because it's something that uh, I have very little knowledge of and never really thought too much about. Um, and what it is, is it's a backpack that will protect your electronic gear from EMP, from RFID, and also from your phone being tracked. So it is a backpack that's actually going to protect you from all those things. But on top of that, it also is a waterproof dry bag style backpack. So it's an added bonus. Um, and to me, uh, when I started looking into this company, looking into EMP proofing gear, it really became apparent to me that this is an important subject um, and that a lot of people are interested in it. And with the weird times that we're having these days and the, being that prepared citizen that we've been talking about in this video series, is that you need to think about potential issues that could happen um, in your area and how you're going to protect uh, your electronic equipment. So as we all know, in this, at the, in this day and age, um, electronics are so important to how we operate. It's in every aspect of our lives. We all have smartphones, laptops, tablets, um, and that stuff is, you want to keep it protected. Um, because that is the way you're going to connect with your family and loved ones. It's the way you're going to uh, see what's going on in the world as far as news. It's a way of staying connected. So a being able to protect that stuff is really key. And Faraday is a company that specializes in this type of equipment. Um, they have a variety of products, uh, backpacks, uh, different size bags that can hold your equipment. Um, and even the, the base materials for building stuff. So it's a really interesting company, a lot of interesting products. And this product is something they sent me. They wanted me to check it out, and I was willing to, to look at it. And I'm kind of glad I did because it's a very, very cool idea, and it actually works. Um, I've tested it, and we're going to test it today in this video. <clears throat> but what I wanted to show you is that it's a very simple design. This is a dry bag style backpack. Um, it has a roll top. So you've got the closures on the top and then you have Fastex closures on the side. And that is, makes it a roll top bag. As you can see in there, it is coated with this material that is going to protect the electronics in, that's in the bag. But the thing is, you don't have to have just electronics. Of course, with a backpack this size, you could obviously store a lot of gear, radios, chargers, cell phones, laptops. But if you also wanted to use this as a bug out, get home style bag, obviously you have room to store first aid, or pouches, Of course, I've got a radio in here. I've got my charger, my solar charger. So that's gonna be protected. And then things like food, tools. There's a knife I'm carrying. Got a rain poncho, small cook set. So tons of room in this bag. Um, it rolls down to about 16 inches and then unrolled, it's a little over 21. So the bag is lined in a nickel copper material and that's going to help with or actually help with preventing uh, the EMP from affecting your gear or the RFID readers working on it um, and also blocking cell signals, text messages, uh, location on your phone. So if, if keeping security of your of where your whereabouts is important to you, this will do that as well. So, so if you know, protecting your whereabouts is important to you, and it may be if you're in working for some type of government agency or police department, or if you just don't want people to know where you're at, you can place your, your phone in here, you cannot be tracked. And I want to show you how that works um, in this next part of the video.
the phone call is not registering on his phone as, a, as something that's going through. It's just going straight to voicemail. Now I pull out my phone, and with my phone, it's an iPhone, there's always a notification that comes up immediately if I'm getting calls or texts. There are no notifications, and there is absolutely no record in my recents that shows that I was that this phone was called. So the blocking is working. It's doing what it's supposed to do. So we tested the capabilities of the bag. It actually works. The phone was shielded completely. No signal got through. So we know that works. Uh, the waterproofness of the bag. Move some of my gear away from here. You can see water rolls right off. It's definitely a waterproof material. Other features of the bag, it has actually a very nice set of padded shoulder straps with a sternum strap, which is, in my mind, really key for a backpack. I always have to have a sternum strap. It helps distribute the load. Uh, it makes it more comfortable on your shoulders when you're carrying weight. Um, of course, these are fully adjustable. I'm a pretty big guy, and I'm able to wear this backpack comfortably. Um, there is padding on the back, so there is a little bit of comfort there. You've got a grab handle, and then uh, they've added these mesh pockets on the outside of the pack, so you can add water bottles. Now, they're not the biggest um, pockets, so you can fit a you know a standard gas station water bottle. Um, in here, I've got a skinny stainless steel bottle that fits pretty well. So. There are some options, but you're not gonna be able to fit your bigger Nalgene's, like your 32 ounce Nalgene's, those won't fit. But at least you do have some kind of option for carrying water with you or other stuff on the outside. Um, and of course this rolls down. And with these straps on top, you can also extend these out and you could put a jacket or something rolled up on top. So that's another option for carrying more gear. Overall impressions of the bag is that it's very well made. Um, it's everything's sealed, um, it's sewn well, it's not cheap in, by any stretch of the imagination. Now, uh, as far as pricing on these, um, they're a little over $100 in that range. Um, I will have links down below to their website so you can check it out for sure and see what, what you think about it. But overall, um, there aren't too many of these types of products on the market that I'm aware of. Um, like I said, I'm a little new to this, but I think this bag is definitely an excellent choice because it's not just a standard backpack, it is also a dry bag. So you can really keep all that sensitive gear that you want to carry with you for whatever reason um, dry and also protected from whatever happens. And that's the key to this, that you don't know what's going to happen, but now you are ready. Um, this would be a great bag for storing um, a lot of your radio gear. If you have multiple radios um, and a laptop and your phones and you're with a group and you want to store it for protection, this would be a great bag for that. Of course, since it's a dry bag, it's great for boating. So you have a lot of options. It's just, a, it's a very cool product. And I, I want to thank Faraday for sending this to me and let me check it out and share it with you guys. Make sure you leave comments down below what you think about something like this. <clears throat> Maybe you have experience with these types of products. Um, I haven't seen too many of these on YouTube. Um, I did, did some searches and I really couldn't find too many videos on it. There's not a lot out there. So hopefully this will help some of you guys out there in making a purchase decision. All right, guys, thanks for watching the video as always. And uh, please check out the Facebook group and Instagram. Those are growing and have extra content. Check out the affiliate links below that helps the channel grow and helps support the channel. Uh, if you're interested in prepared wanderer patches and stickers, those are on the big cartel site. Link down below for that. As always, thank you for watching.